This is my little brother George. This is Bobby Pig. And this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. <laughs> school is a trip. Peppa and her friends are going on a school bus trip. Children! <laughs> Children! Attention, please. Let's check that you're all here. Peppa and George. Here. <laughs> Rebecca and Richard Rabbit. Here. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Susie Sheep. Here. <laughs> Zoe Zebra. Here. Danny Dog. Here. <laughs> Emily Elephant. Here. <laughs> Pedro Pony. Pedro Pony is not here. Sorry we're late. Pedro, you almost missed the school trip. Sorry, Madam Gazelle. Never mind, you're just in time. All aboard! Hey. <laughs> Miss Rabbit is the bus driver. Full steam ahead. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> <laughs> Children, attention please. Today we are going on a trip to the mountains. Hooray! Have you all remembered the type of forces? Yes, yes Madam Gazelle. Gravity, friction, normal force, tension, and applied force. Have you all remembered the free body diagrams? Yes, yes Madam Gazelle. The gravity is always facing down. The normal force is facing perpendicular to the ground. The friction is on the left. And the force acting is the opposite of friction. Madam Gazelle, please can we eat our lunch now? Peppa, we'll eat lunch when we arrive in the mountains. Peppa, what if you... Is your knowledge of physics? Box. A red apple. That falls and bonks Isaac Newton on the head. He then came up with three laws, Newton's laws. First, things stay still or keep moving unless a force push or pulls it. Second, things have more acceleration when more force is added, meaning, force equals mass times acceleration. Third, for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. I've got a green apple. <laughs> Swap. Okay. <laughs> Peppa, Susie, what are you doing? Susie asked what I know. Peppa told me the Newton's law. Oh, that's fine. But please, save some food for the picnic. Yes, Madam Gazelle. <laughs> the bus has arrived at the foot of the mountains. The mountain road is very steep. Come on, bus. You can make it. Children, this is the cause of a second force. Instead of normal X and Y axis, we now have an X and Y axis parallel to the mountain's angle. This makes gravity force split into two different forces, which is based on the angle. Pepper and her friends are at the top of the mountain. <laughs> Peppa loves picnics. Everyone loves picnics. Where are the ducks? They always turn up when we have picnics. Silly Peppa. Ducks don't live on top of mountains. <coughs> oh. <coughs> Hello, Mrs. Duck. Would you like some bread? The ducks are very lucky today. There is lots of bread. The ducks are eating too quickly. Goodness me! <laughs> home time! All aboard! It's time to go home. Everybody has had a great time. <laughs> Let's all... all learn more physics. Can we learn about net forces? Oh, oh. Please, Please, Madam, Madam Gazelle. Gazelle. Learn about net forces. Children, what happens when we have two forces pulling opposite directions? I know. It creates a more overall force. Ooh. Correct, Pepper. And we call that net force. So if you have five newtons one way and three newtons the other, we do three newtons subtracted by five newtons. Therefore, we get the net force two newtons. We're playing a tune and we're singing a song with a bing and a bong and a bing. Bong, bing, move, bing, bong, bing.